Well, today was a really exciting day for hundreds of Indiana students from across the state as they participated in a robot state championship competition that was hosted by Indiana First Indiana Robotics on the University of Indianapolis campus. Logan Gay checked out the competition and joins us in studio right now. Logan, what kind of robots are we talking about here? Well, Delia, those robots are made of more than Legos. You know, they are, they were the, the talented students use their creativity and their STEM skills to create something. They will be the beginning of them possibly changing the world one day. Science, technology, engineering, and mathematics are what STEM is all about. And these students competing here at the first Lego League State Championship have it down pat. FIRST is an acronym meaning for inspiration and recognition of science and technology. Ten-year-old Cassio Rudolph says his team, the Little Governors, put a lot of thought behind their project. We wanted to use thermal electric energy that we produce from body heat to uh, make a heating pad that can incorporate it and cure, cure arthritis. Rudolph says the inspiration behind the robots came after they learned about the disease from their teacher, who has been living with arthritis for nearly five years. The teams were challenged to take their love for STEM and use it to solve problems in their own communities. I think that if we can somehow figure out how, how to cure arthritis, it can go on for years and help millions. The students are competing for an invitation to compete with teams around the world at the first World Festival, which will be held in Houston next year. Organizers with First Indiana Robotics say this competition is about more than the robots. This is a way to look at the workforce pipeline and we are a piece that can plug in to get these students not only into like colleges within Indiana, but also into the workforce in Indiana. And preparing them for life no matter what they decide to build of it. Yeah, well, Julia, you know, this organization not only helps uh, the students learn about building robots, yeah. but also building confidence and finding their own communities. You know, organizers hope the teams walked away today with skills to be a better and more prepared student. It's really encouraging to hear, like, not only are they, like, doing, we did science products and stuff growing up, but they have such a good understanding of what they're doing, too. It's really impressive. Thank you for sharing that story Thank with you. the slogan. <laughs>